So that's Zaude. It's huge. It's sort of shaped like a ring. Anybody with fingers big enough for that wouldn't have any trouble taking over the world. There's no way Alexei could fit that on his finger. I wonder if we'll get in without being seen. Whoa, look! Over there! Pharaoh. Pharaoh's one of the strongest in Delakea. And even he couldn't do anything to it. What did we get ourselves into? It reconstituted itself by manipulating the air. What processing speed? Is that the power Alexei was after? Let's go in from below. Pharaoh's doing all the work, but at least he's got Alexei looking up for now. Pharaoh, thank you. I'd like to know one thing before we begin this battle. Just how strong is this Commandant? I heard he earned his knighthood when he won a royal tournament during the previous Emperor's reign. I got to cross swords with him once, and I didn't last more than three minutes. His title is more than mere decoration. His skill puts him well above his fellow knights. He's the strongest among them, huh? And don't forget, he's surrounded by his royal guard. None of this sounds very promising. Hey, we've got De Nomos, don't we? <laughs> Besides, we've been through all kinds of stuff together on this journey. Yeah, we're tighter than any kind of guard, royal or not. All right, so say we handle the royal guard. It's still a coin toss in the end. I guess we'll never be too prepared when it comes to facing Alexei. Any error will likely cost lives. Right. We'll have to give it everything we've got. Man, up close, this thing is bigger than I thought. Is this really one big Blastia? There's no way! It's gotta be a Hopeland Blastia designed to threaten everyone in the world! It must possess unimaginable power. Hey, look! It's a ship! Is it the Knights? No, I can't believe they'd make it here this fast. It's probably the Royal Guard. That must mean... Yep, the entrance is closely guarded. They're swarming like sea roaches! There aren't that many. We could blow them away before they knew what hit them. Easy. We're not here to get noticed. Let's see if there isn't some other way in. So Pharaoh's been absorbing air too. Is he trying to restabilize it? We owe him one for keeping the fight up this long. No, I don't think that's it. My guess is he's taking in all that air to disable Zaude's power source. That way he'll be able to mess with Alexei's plants, right? Right. Right, Judith? Who? Me? 
What was the question? Never mind. It'll be easy if we can just get inside. We'll stop everything in one shot. Wish it were that easy, kid. But we'll be up to our ears in traps and royal guards. Gotta admire his confidence. Do you really mean that? Pharaoh, please be okay. There's a breeze. It's a vent. Leave it to me! Are we going to enter through here? It might not be what you're used to as a knight, but yeah. Rita, don't worry. I'm fine. Please, I'm, I'm not worried. You clearly are. You're the only one shouting. Got it! Wonderful. Let's take a look. We've seen plenty of Blastia so far, but this one's in a different class altogether. If this was made at the end of the Garayo civilization, it may contain clues to all their technology. Chances are pretty good if the building we saw on that relief in Miorzo is actually Zaude. So is there a connection between the Cataclysm and the Autophagos? If it does come from the end of the Garayo civilization, maybe it can turn back the Autophagos. I wonder if that's why they carved the relief. It all adds up, but I keep going back to Pharaoh's words. About disturbing Zaude? Thinking about it isn't likely to get us anywhere. We just have to go on. a man of grace and honor. His skills were renowned, which kept him on constant secret missions. Every knight knew his name, and nearly everyone envied his ability to carry out his duties with poise. Huh? Is that true? And while he was scrupulous, he knew how to care for those under him, so he always had their trust. After seeing three of them, 
I can see he was well liked. The more I hear about him, the further he seems from that old man. That's why I'm telling you, I'm not Schwan. <laughs> when did he get here? Listen to yourselves, carrying on as though nobody's around. But sometimes you do say things that Captain Schwan would. You continue to carry his quality, however quiet. Not that off, would you? Raven? Hmm? What you need, lad? I know this is a subject you would like to avoid, but I want to ask you something as a knight. Why would Schwan obey Alexei's orders, is it? I cannot believe Captain Schwan would be so blind as to miss the nefariousness of Alexei's deeds. You put too much stock into Schwan. His head was as empty as a tin soldier. The Schwan that would fulfill his duty like a puppet died a decade ago. That would not change, even if he knew what he does now? Well, I don't think he would have seen a blasty of that size coming. But he still might have followed Alexei to the last. But you never can know, can you? Is the reason you wish to settle things now because you have chosen to live as Raven? There are some folks who took this old man seriously. So I guess I can't die just yet. But if I'm going to live on, then I've got to make up for what Schwan did. So a fortuitous encounter changed you. That's putting it a bit dramatic. I've been wondering about this for a while now. What? How come the Royal Guard is so loyal to Alexei? That's true. You'd think they'd have come to their senses by now. Well, did you know that most of the Imperial Knights are taken as apprentices from the nobility? Yeah, I wish I could forget. Well, the Royal Guard protects the Emperor, and they're made up of the finest soldiers in the Imperial Knights. Hasn't it been several years since we've had an Emperor, though? Exactly. In that time, the Commandant's cleverly made those knights into his own personal army. It doesn't seem like that'd be enough to turn them into such little lapdogs, though. Well, the ideals he offered them were attractive in their own ways. Lead our empire to prosperity, what have you. They were all so enamored with him, earnestly believing his every word. Even now, I imagine they believe in him. I cannot blame them for that. But if you realize what kind of person he is, Flint, then why can't they...? The world would probably be a better place if all those guys figured out the truth on their own. Oh, shark!
It's beautiful. Yeah, I can't believe we're inside a weapon. Carol, wait. Huh? Get out here. You're too old for hide and seek. Bravo! Bravo, my lads. Splendid! Such keen intuition, such sharpened instincts. Simply splendid! Jaeger! What is it this time? Are you gonna show us how to get to Alexei? Yeah! Oh, yeah! I will show you the way. To hell, that is! Just which way's the wind blowing with this guy anyway? Have you forgotten, my pretties? We are still sworn enemies, you know. Things were destined to end this way between us. Is this another trap? It's just like you said. We're enemies. So let's do what enemies do. You are correct. Come. Bring it. Why? You helped us in Heracles. Terribly sorry, but friendship does not last an eternity. Whatever your reasons are, you could still help us defeat Alexei. Now that is a fantasy. You're right. Let's finish this. Here is a symphony of my attack.
It doesn't feel right. How could this happen? Stronger and stronger. Yeah! That's the line. Wunderbar. You know, I'm not really one for vengeance and all, but this is for the Don. Be careful. He might still have something up his sleeve. No, no, no. These sleeves are empty. This is... Yeah. This is it. Your chest. Did Alexei do that to you as well? My... I wonder... But what's done is done. Why? Why did you fight alone? With nothing, and no one to help you. <laughs> Goodbye. Wait, where's Alexei? What is he trying to accomplish? Why? Leviathan's Claw. What a sad ending. Hey. They were both crying. What... what was that all about? He was... an awful person. But maybe he also... Alexei, your transgressions against Lady Estelise and Captain Schwan shall not go unpunished. But I cannot believe your vision was entirely lies. Before we battle, I want to know why this happened. If you keep making a face like that, you'll scare away all the fish. Forgive me. Thinking of the upcoming fight against Alexei makes me tense. Uh, I know how you feel. I've got a score to settle with Alexei myself. We're all alike on that point. But Alexei isn't around at the moment, so relax and have yourself a skewer or two. Good idea. What do you say, Flynn? My skewers can't be beat. I shall relish eating them.
wasn't too bad. I can do even better than this. Jaeger. You and me were in the same position, but took entirely different paths in life. Yeah, one of us stayed with the knights, and the other became a guild chief. <laughs> Both of us ended up spineless men who did whatever we were told. I was only with the Don because I was ordered to be there. Is that true? I was sent in undercover to spy on the Union. The Don caught on, of course, but he let the whole thing slide. He was like, if you're after my head, then try me any time. Hey, that sums it up nicely. There's no hiding from it. And your pride kept you beholden to the Union as well. Exactly. I was leading a double one. I'm a mess of a man, I'll say. <laughs> Something wrong? This looks just like... Could it be? Oh, what's that? This is the Maristella. That's the Maristella? The treasure that you've been searching for? I... What? Seriously? I never imagined we'd find it in a place like this. 
been searching for it for so long. And now I finally found it. Well, what are you gonna do next? Weren't you gonna use that as a clue to find your grandpa? I. But now's not the time. Wait, but wasn't Ifri the one who hid the Maristella? Now's hardly the time to be excited over some treasure. I. We need to hurry up and beat that scallywag Alexei to a pulp. he's got, why would Jaeger come along? Well, he did have his two lady friends with him, though they didn't attack us. Who knows? Maybe he thought dying would be the easiest way to solve his problems. What do you mean? I'm not too sure myself. Guess there's no looking back now. We're taking Alexei down. It's that simple. We can't let the world become any more chaotic than it already is. It's up to us to stop him. Everything we've done is for this moment. Every one of us is ready for whatever may happen. Let's do this. <laughs>
said something about finding a treasure earlier. What was it? It's the Maristella. Having it in my hands really voiced my honor among pirates. Who's honor? Is it really that special? That little thing? It's not only small. If I have an itch on my head, I can use it to scratch it. You can? And if I polish it enough, I can use it as a mirror and find any food stuck on my face. That too? And if I whirl it around just so, it becomes a deadly weapon. And even that? Wait, what am I saying? Why do I always get caught up in your spell, Patty? Merely one of the powers of this symbol. Really? You'll fall for anything, won't you? to fight this one. Show no wasn't too bad. Picked the wrong.
Are they all together? We'll crush them all. I'll blow you away! There's no way we're gonna... Figure this out. Man, what a pain. Why would anyone bother to set up such complicated mechanisms on the ocean floor? It's a common way to keep intruders out. The Shikos ruins were the same way. Places only certain people could enter, that kind of stuff. So only people who know the correct steps can enter? Exactly. But if we rack our brains a little, we should be able to figure it out. So why haven't we figured it out yet? You tell us, Captain. You're the master puzzle solver. What? Uh, since when? Since now, so put on your thinking cap and figure this out. Ugh, I can't believe this. you crawled out from. Bring it.
The dog's looking a little spooked. It's okay, Repeat. Why do you look so happy, Rita? Who, me? Repeat being scared makes you happy. Huh. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, he's just a little nervous around water, that's all. Exactly. So being on the seafloor is a bit intense for him, right? A little tough, huh?
should really enjoy these little times together. Wasn't too bad. Wasn't too bad. Thank you. 
Victory calls. That's far enough. We'll never let you through. The Royal Guard? Then Alexei must be just up ahead. He's gotta be. All right, guys, let's do this. There's still a lack of devotion. Here. I almost feel sorry for them. Captain, are you all right? Sodia, Witcher, were you able to withstand Zod's attacks? The ships are anchored at a distance. We're the advance party. Those who came after us have divided into small groups and are proceeding with the landing. You're being cautious. That's smart. If you came in force and got caught, that'd be the end of that. From here on, this is our duty. You need to withdraw. Perky as ever, aren't you? Sorry, but we're gonna ignore you on that one. If we did that, everything we've done up until now would be for nothing. I think we should cooperate, but that's just me. I, we've all come to defeat Alexei after all. She's right. We're all here to bring Alexei down. Well, and save the world in the process, right? Yeah, I heard. Okay, then, let's all play nice and go pound this guy. Everyone's here. Welcome to the very depths of the ocean. It's over, Alexei. Don't add to your crimes any further. Ah, Princess Esteles. How nice to see you up and about. Which tells me Jaeger was useless. He's dead. I thought surely he'd come through in the end, but oh, how I was mistaken. Is toying with the destinies of others how you have your fun? Alexei, what happened to the ideals you held? What changed? Flynn, are you still saying things like that? Nothing has changed except my methods. Absolute power is all that can revive this rotting, stagnant empire. Indeed, the world. And just how many lives do you plan to sacrifice to acquire it? No true reformation could occur, so long as I followed the means presented by the empire. You should understand this well. Whoa, whoa. Don't tell me you're actually listening to this drivel. 
Nonsense! It's all nonsense! Every word out of his mouth is a lie! Why have you taken such a hurtful path? Someone of your stature could have found another way! At times, dreamers must suffer being branded as criminals. But I'll suffer such burdens gladly. I promise to free this world from the Entelechaea, from the air, and from this pitiful empire. This world shall be reborn! I don't give a damn what you're doing this for. And you're making a lot of people cry. And that's enough of a reason to take you down! There's no turning back now. How tedious. If you'll excuse me, I'm a very busy man. such questions even from you none of you none thinks the empire is in the right the ends don't always justify the means boss these kids taught me that i could never agree with your way of doing things a way that is filled with pain if you truly have no intention of changing your ways then the guilds and the empire both have good points you can't just wipe them out and start over using force will surely breed resentment and contempt you do know that, don't you? There's no guarantee the world you'd make would be any better than this one. I didn't place my trust in you so you could force your ideas on the entire world. If realizing your vision requires destruction, then I have no choice but to end you here and now. All the booty in the world couldn't make me sign on as part of your twisted dream. Nobody's gonna buy what a bastard like you says. I see my explanations are wasted on you. The small-minded always fear change. However, all the air in the world is now in my grasp. You have no hope of victory. Yeah, right. You're still trying to figure out the formula for this place. What? Rita, what do you mean? This guy still hasn't completely unlocked Zaude's controls. Is he just buying time? Ah, uh, yes. Rita Mordio. How very careless of me. Are you serious? And you think you can change the world? Don't make me laugh. How very right you are. Very well. Then this will be one more trial along my path to my rightful place as ruler. <laughs> you will be the first sacrifice made for the New World's Dawn. Come! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I thought he didn't have all of Zaude's power yet. He doesn't, but he may have enough. Huh. He's betting the world on this. He's gotta pull out all the stops. Let's go! This world... Thank <laughs> you. 
that's enough for now. Now the law will give you your due punishment. You won't just get away with saying you're sorry. I can do even better than this. It's over, Alexei. Is this the top of Zauda? Is that the core? It... Huh? Continued the analysis this whole time? We will witness together the might of Zaude. No! You fool! that much air? No. This catastrophe has always waited there. Wha what do you mean? The Autophagos was never eliminated. It was just sealed off far from sight. Yes. And now it has returned to spread the ruin it once rained down upon the ancients. And to think, I caused it all! The ultimate irony! <laughs> you mean Zauda had been holding it back this entire time? Never more than worms writhing before an approaching storm. The 
time has come, our death draws near. No one can escape its doom! <laughs> Shut up already, you bastard! <laughs> It seems in the end that I <laughs> was the greatest fool of all. <laughs> Where's Yuri? I'm sure that he's over there somewhere. The Autophagos disappeared into the void. Yeah, well, guess they didn't really say they destroyed that thing. They just went off and left this piece of crap remnant behind. Uh, Flynn? My room. Why? Didn't think she hated me this much. Oh. Huh? The child of the full moon? The leaders of the ancients possessed an innate power, and were called the children of the full moon. The shrine of Zaude received their lives and power. It sealed the autophagus away, saving the world. You have awakened. Duke, so it was you who saved me. I couldn't afford to have this sword lost to the sea forever. Okay. I still owe you my thanks. So the Shrine of Zaude was powered by the lives of the children of the full moon? Humans brought forth the Autophagos and led it. Consider it atonement. The few remaining children of the full moon, together with the Antilochea, decided on how the world would be. The Imperial family are their descendants. So that's how the Empire started. And that's why that sword, the key to Zaude, will prove a true Emperor. As long as air is used, no one can oppose the Autophagos. For it is born of air itself. You wanted to stop the Autophagos, too. That's why you were going around calming all the air crene, right? Correct. Why didn't you ask for help from the Empire or the Guilds? You could have stopped Alexei if you'd done that. I have aligned myself with the Entelikea. I What's more, the masses of humanity will never come to any accord. So, what are you trying to do? The Autophagos was too much, even for that ancient civilization. There is a way. 
You say you despise humanity, but what about us? Aren't we human? Why did you give me De Nomos? Why did you cooperate? You were the only ones who even attempted to communicate with the Entelechea. That is why. Never mind, it is done. Wait, what are you gonna do? I will protect our world, our Terka Lumares. Hold on! Ugh. Damn it! <laughs>